Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Um, it was just Mother's Day and I am super excited to show you what I got from my family, my wonderful two kids and my boyfriend Michael. Um, I got the Lush Mother's Day gift set. I don't know what this one is. Oh, it's called Flowers for Mom. Um, little bit of a secret. I did I did hint largely <laughs> to get this. Um, I absolutely love Lush. I, um, hmm. I'm just really excited. So I'm going to say I'm um a lot because whatever, I'm all, all over the place. Anyway, so this is the, um, flowers for mom gift set. And here is the little tag that it comes with, which is super adorable. It says flowers for mom and you can actually plant this, um, you can plant this card and flowers will bloom. So that is super cool. Um, I did open this up. So this is not an unboxing or anything. Um, I couldn't, it was, was, this was tied so beautifully. Like it was an actual, looked like a, an actual flower. Okay. So this looked like an actual flower. Um, and I tried to do it as well as I could, but I don't work for Lush. I don't know how they do it, how they make them so beautifully. But anyways, let me just open it and I will show you everything that is in here. I thought I had to do this video right away because um, I just want to get into these products and use them right away. Oh my God, they're just so gorgeous. So right off the bat, like I said, there it comes with this tag that you can plant and it will bloom flowers. So how cool is that? All right, so that's that little tag. And inside, it just shows all the products that come with it. And as you can see, it has a ton, a ton, a ton. I am such a lucky mom um, to be getting this. Oh, it smells so great. So here is the scarf that it comes with, which is super gorgeous. I have been looking for something super bright like this for a little while. I wanted to DIY a little kimono for my daughter um, and she loves the colors um, pink and she loves flowers so this is just going to be absolutely stunning. If I, oh I don't know if I want to cut this up, it's just so pretty. Um, if anything I will use it as a little like picnic blanket for her. Uh, we do, we have been starting to have little picnics in our yard so she might want to do that. I will ask her what she wants to do. Anyway, so it comes in a bowl thing like this with a little paper mache bowl and these are the products that it comes with inside. Oh, I really wish that like there was a way that you guys can smell how great this smells right now. Oh, so unbelievable. Those are the products and I am just going to start. I am having very, really bad lighting issues in here right at this moment. Um... Hmm. I wonder if I, if it'll help if I just adjust there, that might be a little bit better. So I am just going to have my little cheat sheet because I do not know what everything is in here. I kind of quickly looked. First thing that I got was the Rose Argan body conditioner. It's a skin conditioner. And this is, let me see if there's any. Okay. So it smell smell the roses with this in shower body moisturizer <laughs> smell the roses with this in shower body moisturizer loaded with fragrant oils and butters to leave your skin looking glorious and feeling smooth just have a little smelly smell oh i'm in love i am absolutely in love okay so this product i have used and i actually have a few um a few jars of it on the go at all times um i started using this about uh maybe about four months ago um on the regular it's the dream cream hand and body lotion i don't know what it is like i always have dry hands and i'm like moisturized like crazy but my hands are always very dry and they always have been, but I found that my hands have improved drastically. I actually keep a container like this right by the computer, right, right by my computer. Um, and I mean, it's just like, it's normally I go for a heavier cream. This one is not so heavy, but when I put this one on, it just like a little bit really goes a long way. And I just, I love everything about this. So go out and try this. If you are like, have somebody, like you are somebody with very dry skin, this stuff is so great. It's not sticky. It's not, um, uh, 
what's that word that I, it, it actually stays, a, the, you can feel the layer on your skin and it, it just wor it works really, really well. All right, so the next thing is the 9 to 5 Cleansing Lotion. Um, and this is an orchid scent. It's um, orchid and almond oil. And it's a clean and a whew, lotion to cleanse and refresh it. Oh, what is wrong with me? I'm so excited about this one that I seriously cannot even talk. Um, all right, let me just read it off the thing because I am not doing a good job of explaining myself. Um, this is the 9 to 5 Cleansing Lotion. It beautifully... Beautifully light orchid and almond. Oh. Hi. Take a breath. Gian. <laughs> oh my God. Okay. Beautifully light orchid and almond oil lotion to cleanse and ref. Beautifully light orchid and al. <laughs> I seriously, I'm not drunk in any way. All right. Okay, so this is the 9 to 5 cleansing lotion. Um, this is super, super, super nice. It's um, an orchid and almond oil lotion, and it just smells like fantastic. I'm just going to open this up, remind myself. Of how it smells actually this I remember this now this is a very light smell but it actually feels really nice on your skin after a bath you put this on mm, this is seriously the best day of my life I have to say okay so this I've never tried and I've been dying to try them they actually kind of freak me out because um, I have super long hair and using a shampoo bar or a bar of sh a bar of soap is what I kind of get into my head, but I have to remember that this is lush and this is going to be fantastic. This is the Jason and the Argan Oil Shampoo Bar. Extra points for such an amazing name, um, but this is you just lather it up um, and wash your hair with it, and it's supposed to leave your your hair super super shiny. Argan Oil is known to make your hair super shiny. Um, I find that a lot of the argan oils that I have tried before are, um, because my hair is so long, it leaves it uh, very, very greasy and very yucky, but it actually feels soft and it, so it's kind of like a catch 22 for me. So this one was going to be really interesting to try because it is in a bar form. So maybe it, because it's not an actual like oil that it won't do that and it won't have that kind of like, it feels like buildup when I use um, a lot of argan oil like shampoos and the leave-in treatments. So super excited to try this. I will not try this until I get myself a little tin though, because I have a feeling that this is just going to, because obviously I share my shower with my boyfriend that he might, I don't know, he might wreck this in some way and I'll be super sad. But anyway, so that's one that I'm super excited to try. Um, this is another one that I'm very excited to try. This is the, I'm just reading off my list here, is the Dreamtime Luxury Bath Melt. It's a lavender and chamomile essential oil um, uh, bath melt. So let me just have a little smell of this. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay. I don't know if I really want to open this because I just squished I just squished it just a little bit and it's actually really, really sticking to the packaging. Okay. Oh, oh my god. That just feels so amazing. Like like actually touching a stick of butter. Like so super soft. That's so fantastic. Okay. Uh, right after this video, I am going to be using this. I'm not even joking. I already know that's the first thing that I'm going to try. So this um, I have used before as well, and I'm so happy to see that it came in this. This is the Turkish Delight Shower Smoothie. Um, and let me see. Let me just open it so you can see the inside of it. It's like such a really strange eye consistency. It's almost like a mousse. Um, if you can look at it, it's very solid. Um, it doesn't come with a lot of a product in this, but it'll, like this really does go a long way. And it says, we've captured a whole Turkish rose field in this pot. Come up smelling of roses after you, you use this rich softening shower smoothie. Um, it's really interesting because when I used to feel like 
anything with roses in it where it was like it's going to be strong on my sensitive skin but it's actually not it's actually so soothing it smells great um I know it's an acquired smell. I remember being like, okay, in my younger days, like my teenage days, like I really wanted things that were very fruity or um, vanilla-ish and whatever. And maybe like the more and more I mature that I'm more getting more into floral scents, but I feel like they actually really like uplift my spirits and they really like feel great on my skin. Um, and this is one product that just seriously, just like, feels so good and just smells so good and anytime like I've used any of like especially the lush products with rose in it um I get so many compliments like you smell so good and I believe it like this is just so fantastic so again um if you can get your hands on this definitely one to try is the Turkish delight love 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 okay um this I've been dying to try and I, I don't know why I haven't yet I think I just I get into Lush and I'm so distracted and I get all the things that I really like and I usually try to get one or two things that I um I've never tried before but um I don't know why I haven't tried this okay so this is the celestial face moisturizer this is a teeny tiny little thing of it but I know that this is one of their more expensive um moisturizers but let me see if I can open this one Oh yeah, I can. I don't want to accidentally waste any because it is like really precious. All right, so okay, it doesn't doesn't have much of a scent to it. It's just a little bit of a moisturizer. Let me see if I got that like tiny little bit. Oh, ooh, hello. <laughs> All right, well that feels absolutely fantastic. Um, let me see if this says anything about it. It's a gentle blend of cocoa butter, vanilla, water, and almond milk to keep even se even sensitive skin hydrated soft and glowing and i can feel already with that little bit that i try i just put on my hand that it is going to be super moisturizing um and one that will really stay on my face like i really i i do like um products that like my skin does soak up but i like to feel it throughout the day like after i put it on i really want to feel like um like it's sitting on my skin and just hydrating me throughout, especially in the nighttime. Um, when I fall asleep, I want to feel it. And when I wake up, I want to still feel that that product is there and that it has been like just working its magic all night long. All right. So on to my favorite part, you guys. Oh, my goodness. This is the Secret Garden Bath Bomb. And how pretty is that? I really have to hide this from my daughter, Ollie, because she, as soon as she sees this, she's going to love it. She loves anything that are that is this these colors. Like I said, um, this is the Secret Garden Bath Bomb. Unlock the door to tranquility and discover a bouquet of flower petals in your bath with this fragrant rose absolute balm. Oh, oh my gosh. Like again, like I said, the smell of roses absolutely love it all right so this other one here is the rose bombshell bath bomb bursting with rose petals skin softening soy milk powder and a gorgeous fragrance of orange flower absolute and rose oil oh this just smells so fresh so like so light Oh, I just, I absolutely love the smell. Like with all those ingredients, you would think that they would be overpowering of a smell, but it isn't to me. I don't know. It might be for some people, um, but it definitely isn't to me. The only thing that I'm disappointed about with this is that when I saw the um, actual like uh, spoiler for this or not spoiler, but when I looked online to see what was in the contents of this, they actually showed it and it had a bit of a, like a small rose in it. And it was just so pretty and so like nice. I don't know if mine just doesn't have it or they didn't put it on or it broke off somewhere in the process but it's not there but nonetheless i still love it and i'm going to be happy to use it last thing um save the best for last and how pretty is this this is the rose bubble bar a work of art inside and out with rose absolute to soothe the spirit and cocoa butter to soften the skin and i mean i'm i'm such a fan of their, bu their bubble bars. I don't know if you've tried them before. Let me know which ones you like because I'm actually new to using the bubble bars. I've, oh, I've always been a bath bomb kind of a person. Um, but I found like over the last like year, my kids have just been taking my bath bombs and just like using them before I can get them. So I haven't been using them and I was like, you know what, I'm gonna get a bubble bar one that doesn't look like a bath bomb so much because I, I don't wanna share. And um, right now they're not, 
they are not hip to um, what these are actually like, what these actually do, and that they, they are could go in the bath. So until then, I am gonna cherish them. So if you have one that you totally like, please let me know, and I will give that a try. So let me just open this and have a little smelly smell. Okay, so I just broke mine. You can see I just broke it in my excitement, but that's okay because I am gonna put throw that in my bath nonetheless. Oh my God, you guys, I, I can't say it enough. I wish that you could just jump right in here and smell these. Oh, this does smell like rose, but it smells so fruity. It smells absolutely gorgeous. What is this smell that I'm smelling? Okay, rose with spirits of cocoa butter. Okay, there's there's something that's almost citrusy in a smell that I'm smelling in this, but I can't pinpoint what it is, but it just, oh, it's gonna, it's so fantastic. So anyways, that's everything that I got in my Lush Flowers for Mom um, gift set. I hope you all had a happy Mother's Day, whether you're a mom or you're celebrating with your moms or what have you. I had such a great weekend and um, I hope you did too. Okay, well, I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.